Hello and welcome back to Dicking Around with Dick Tracy. Today's case, the Kidnap Capa, or something like that. Um, so now we're heading over to 2nd and C. Because um, we just talked to the Brow after defeating his fucking army of gang gangsters. I mean, Christ almighty, man. Uh, no. There's a sniper over here. Okay, let's try that again, alright. And he told us that he left a handkerchief over at 2nd and C, which means investigation! Heh! He blocked. Oh god, these guys are so punch-happy! I don't like this. I really don't like these. I liked it better when I could just punch the fuck out of their dicks. And that was it. That's all I had to do. I wish I still had my tear gas on me. Oh no! Hey dude, if you want to take care of that rat down there at your feet, <laughs> be my guest. Uh, business card, cloak and dagger imports, 6th and G. Whatever. Just another arbitrary clue. 6th and G, okay. <laughs> As I completely forget what it was. I don't like the doggies. I don't want to hurt the doggy dogs. Ah! Please give me health. God fucking damn it. Seriously, please give me health. Look at all these rats! What kind of auto shop is this? Now shop for rats? Heh, <laughs> heh. Oh, shit, fuck. Okay. Sixth and G? I think. Die, that's the point. Shit. Uh, sixth and G, it is. <clears throat> Alright. They're over at sixth and G office, apparently. Um, to investigate a handkerchief. Ooh! Shit. There we go. Um, hopefully, this office, uh, you know office for a doctor or a nurse, you know, some sort of healer, because I'm fucking dying! <laughs> There's no way I'm gonna get through this. Even with the amazing amount of confidence I usually have. Hey, I pointed straight! How'd I do that? Well, no time to figure it out now. <laughs> get my ass kicked. No! Damn it! Alright, alright, are you? Okay, you are a punchy. I call them punchies now. Aren't you a little bit punchy? I a little punchy. Who's a little punchy? Oh, you fucker! God damn dick sucking fucking bitch and cunt! Hello, and welcome back to Dick and Around with Dick Tracy. Um. <laughs> I, I don't even know where to begin. So, um. We're heading back to that stupid office. Actually, no, 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 no. Before we go, I'm going on a health run. Um, as ill-fated as this will be. And I feel like I've said that before already. This is actually my second day of this case. Um, I finally caved and used the save state to uh, get back to this point. Because, honestly, I was just getting really sick of having to re-go through all these buildings over and over again. And also, I didn't want to have to play this game for more than like two hours or something that I ended up playing it last time, so. So I'm going back to this fresh now, after loading a save state. Um, fortunately, I didn't forget where I was. And, uh, you know, I just wanted to save some time. And now that I've said that, let's, uh, let's show me uh, going through a building I've already been through to uh, get health. <laughs> Doesn't make sense. Don't shoot straight. What the? I don't think you can shoot straight. Um. Yeah. 
I don't, I don't know anymore. I'm getting kind of sick of this level. This case, I mean. Um, it's been going on for a while. And some random thing to do with a handkerchief. I still don't... I'm not quite sure I know what's uh, going on with that. Clues don't even make sense. It was kind of fun, like, just figuring out, like, how we were following these leads, you know, but now it's just... I don't get it. <laughs> we found a ransom note made out of letters from a magazine. We found the guy who had owned the magazine. He said he left the magazine in a place that had a handkerchief. We're now going to the office of the place that made the handkerchief. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> it doesn't make sense. Then again, you know, fake $20 bill. <laughs> That's all there is to it. Ah, oh, fuck. Alright, and this is pretty much how it's gonna be. <laughs> I've decided. I haven't decided. The game has. That's just how it's gonna go. That's how it's going down now. <laughs> One Tommy Gun bullet. Uh, I was doing pretty good so far. Too bad it takes half a badge falling in water. Again. Not quite sure I understand that. But, uh, it's Dick Tracy. Roll with it. <laughs> I'm gonna die. So hard. Well, fortunately, I didn't have any illusions of grandeur here. I knew the minute I got that first aid kit, I was just gonna use it, so... The fact that I have literally no health left, totally understandable. I, it makes complete sense to me. Eh. That, however... Uh, Alright, well... Alright... First aid... <laughs> Not gonna tell you how many time, tries it took me to get this far again. So, you know what, whatever. I'll, I'll roll that. So... <clears throat> attempting to move on with this fucking case... Um, there's a sniper there. Sixth and G, I think, is the office building. But I'm gonna go ahead and double check my notes yet again. Um, or just try out this building since we're there. And I was right. All right. <laughs> yeah, this is the office that made the handkerchief. I don't. I don't know. I feel like. All right, we're getting somewhere. Eh. Ah, you son of a bitch. I should have stayed ducking. reaching the point where I'm farther than I have been ever. I think, maybe. Uh, yeah. Yep. You have a gun, don't you? Yeah, he has a gun. Yeah! Ah. Okay. Whoa! Look at these two. Alright. Oh, doggy! Oh, I just punched the fuck out of that dog, apparently. <laughs> God damn it. Might have to be dogs. Now I feel guilty. Whoa! What the fuck, I can't hit him. There we go. Yeah, I know there's a clue down there, but I'm gonna take my time just for a minute. There we go. Well, so far not too bad. Um, maybe there's gonna be more health. Discarded note: keep him at first and J. 
basement. B. Oh, interesting. Wait, so... I go to first and J. I wonder who B is. I'm gonna make a guess of who uh, the culprit is. Let's see if I'm right. Even though it's, I don't think there's too many Bs, so... Ah! Of course. There's no health here. First and something. <laughs> Damn it! God. Uh, this happens. Um, I don't want to try something because I think if you go, well, it's first and something. So I'm just gonna go back to this police station. It's like three police stations in this map. Um. Oh, hi, sniper barrel. That I can't see the rest of you. Um. Fuck. Well, never mind. <laughs> um. I'm going to cut here and go on a health run, so you guys don't have to see it. Yeah. Be right back, hopefully. Alright, so I have health now, and it was... First and J. Okay. I think I was right, I don't remember. Oh, B. Yeah, I was going to see who B was. Uh, the brow. Totally. Brow did it. Oh, no. If it was Brow, then I have to go through his fu- Ah, oh, shit. This is gonna suck. I think I have to go through his place again. That was just ridiculous. Alright, first and J will be all the way the hell up here. There's so many snipers, it's weird. I think when I was replaying these missions and going to just the buildings with the clues in them, I skipped a lot of the snipers that I normally would have gotten, like this fucker. Okay, I'm gonna test it now. Hopefully. So I have two and a half badges, right? I had three, then I got shot. Like an asshole. Um, but what would happen if I went into the police station? It's a death trap, seriously, that car. Uh, anyway. Hit the streets. Oh, okay. Man, well maybe it's if you're just at half it gives you a full badge instead. Which is still kinda nice, but I was hoping maybe going to the police station turned a half into a hole. <laughs> Moving on. Nice gesture, you know. <laughs> Keep a lookout for snipers. Yeah, see I haven't taking care of these guys. I think they're in the same spot each time. Pretty certain. Uh, first and J. Is there a first and I? Oh god. Hey, there's a first and I. Huh. Alright, first and J. Let's die again, shall we? 